September 15th, 1963. It was the day of the Youth Day Sunday service at 16th Street Baptist Church in Birmingham, Alabama. Four little girls, Addie Mae Collins, Denise McNair, Carol Robertson, and Cynthia Wesley, they were all there getting ready, making final adjustments on their beautiful white dresses when the bomb exploded. The entire nation and indeed internationally, people expressed outrage. How could such a tragedy happen? What a horrible act of racial terrorism. There was one person, a young lawyer named Charles Morgan Jr. He had been scheduled to give a talk in Birmingham. At the last minute, he changed his speech. And when he got up in front of a group of his white peers, he said, who threw that bomb? Was it a Negro? Was it a white? And he looked at that room and he said, we all did it. He went on and he didn't leave the church out of it. What Charles Morgan Jr. was getting at was the idea of complicity in racism, that, that the silence, the apathy, the fear, all contributed to a context of compromise. So this book that I wrote, The Color of Compromise, it says don't look away. Don't look away at the hard parts of history, even and especially when they implicate us our own faith communities or traditions.